Hello everyone. Uh, in this video, I'm with you with one of the easiest assignments of the year. So, we are working on IXL K1. It's about graphing inequalities on a number line. It's not on the coordinate plane. That's why it is easier. So, let's see what is given. It says graph x is less than or equal to negative 3. So, this symbol that sign tells you what side you are going to graph. So x is less than or equal to negative 3. So if it says less than negative 3, that's what you need. Just the point. If it says less than or equal to, the point should be filled in. This means less than, this means the point is included. There is an equal sign in the inequality. So the sign indicates to highlight the left side. This means it's pointing towards left. So this is what I need. So to be able to do this, let me show you. I will clear everything from the screen. Okay. So plot the ends. So there's only one end point here, which is this. That's my end point. Select an endpoint to change it from closed to open. So if you want to turn this into an open circle, just hit the point. That's all you need to do. But I don't want to leave it this way because this means it's not included. But it, is, it should be included. Select the middle of the segment ray or line to delete it. You don't have anything yet. So I'm going to drag this to the left. But if I stop there, that's a line segment. It should go forever to the left. So, it, remember what it says? It says, select the middle of the segment. So, if I select the middle of this, it disappears. Once again, I start from negative 3. I drag it to the left all the way. That's my answer for this question. Okay, moving on to the next level. Uh, less than 7. Hit 7. It says, the variable is going to be less than this number. So, less means towards left. So, I'm going to move up one level x is less than or equal to 87, find 87 over here, less means that way. Moving up one more level, are they going to change the sign at all? Like 46, less than, okay. So, not sure why aren't they changing the sign, I'm going to try to get back down some levels to see if they're going to give me any other sign because this doesn't make sense it's too easy okay uh, so let me do one more okay x is less than or equal to 46 right here less than this would be the answer I want to do this wrong so just to see if they're gonna change the symbol in the middle okay got it Okay, they're not changing the sign in the middle. I guess you're going to have an easier assignment than I thought it would be. I knew that it was going to be easy. I didn't know it was going to be that easy. Okay, less than or equal to 6 plus 6. It says equal. I don't want to end up with an empty circle. So it should be closed. So that would be my answer. Okay, finally they changed the sign. Okay. So this one says x is greater than or equal to 0. So it is still included. I, I need a closed circle. It says x is greater than this number. If it is greater, that sign is what I'm looking for. Let's submit this. Okay, perfect. We have not included point. x is greater than 65. It cannot be equal to 65. So this is not what I'm looking for. This means 65 could be my answer. But according to the inequality, it cannot be my answer. So I hit the point once again. The number is greater than this is on the right side. So that would be my answer for this question. So this is a short video. It's a simple assignment. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm not sure if you're going to watch this video at all, but <laughs> in just in case, uh, Thanks for watching again and I will see you in another video.